Welcome to Mysteries, Figures, Minis, whatever you want to call it. Mystery Monday, as I like to call it. Well, I got some mystery stuff here that, and some mini stuff, like McDonald's. Uh, this came from the Goodwill, as you can tell by the way they price things on them. I saw some people have Goodwills that use price stickers. Well, I was going to use this for Transformers Tuesday, but I figured, meh, it kind of goes with the Monday theme. We also have another lady from Transformers. It's this one. And this is Alita 1 from the new Transformers 1 movie. I heard that was an incredibly big hit movie. I'm um, being facetious. If you can't tell, if you're not able to understand what sarcasm is. All right, so here's the car, vehicle, jet, whatever the heck it is. It looks like a big old fat buddy motorcycle. So uh, it's got a zip line. You put it in. I'm not going to make it go across my table because my table is not that long. So I, I mean, maybe I'll do a little bit, but not. And it doesn't have much grip on it because, of course, it has a table. So, yeah, it's okay. I was hoping they had the figure, but I got that down there. Today uh, was Monday. And, of course, that's why I'm doing the video on Monday. I went to McDonald's for McDonald's Monday. And they had Crocs. Now, this is the Happy Meal toy. I got a blue one with a smiley face on it to go with the red one that I have. I'm not a huge fan of these, but they're cool. They're not the greatest thing in the world, but they're cool. They're cool. Uh, my Happy Meal box actually was just a generic box. It didn't have the Crocs on it. Here are the stickers. Actually, they're different. I thought they'd be the same. Huh. But they're kind of cool. Um, I just wish they came in pairs. So it says number six one of this one. So just remember that in case you're collecting and you want to have number six. I also have this one. I don't know if water is involved with this because in the previous volcanoes I've used, there's water. He doesn't say, he says lava slime. So instead of a volcano with fizzy stuff, it says slime, dinoskeleton collector's guide. You have one volcano. So I'm thinking it is not one of the ones that have the, um, you know, the fizzy stuff in it. I could be completely wrong, but it was also uh, $3.99 at a place called Ross. Now Ross, if you're out there watching, let me know if, uh, how that's going for you owning all these stores. Seems like just yesterday you were my cat meowing. No, I've known Ross for a long time, all the way back to college. And uh, had an awesome, one of my, my friends, I used to rollerblade or, you know, uh, play ice, uh, ice hockey, blade hockey, whatever you heck you call it. So we get a volcano right here and you know normally you put the fizzy water in there and make it fizz up so i guess it's not one of those so we can throw joe in the volcano later here's the little guide which we want to always have a guide always go by the guide and even though the cat's me on a little bit see a little bit was eaten and just completely content until just now he heard my voice he's like i want to get attention now so a little bit Shh, please you, you i'll let you go out later I want to have to do that whole split the video and put it back together thing. All right, so there are six different dinos. There's a Triceratops, T-Rex, Raptor, uh, whatever that is called, Stegosaurus, and no, there's no Catasaurus. Sorry. No, there's no Cadillacs. Oh, I got a T-Rex. I got a T-Rex. Did you like that one a little bit? A little bit says he likes T-Rexes. They're delicious. Sweetheart, you not right now, honey. I, why is it every time I get on the video, I have a cat meowing? And he's demanding too. Listen to that meow. He's like, I want to go and I want to go now. So we're going to go back in there and eat some more cat food or something. I'm like, they come in, they eat, and then they take over my entire life. So this is the sticky stuff a little bit. So I should have some borax water ready for me. So in case I needed it, it's really bright orange. Ooh, pretty. Yeah, it's very sticky. But it's not so sticky that I can't, you know, like that one time I got that stuff, that was miserable. That was bad stuff right there. All right. So good. It sounds like a little bit's finally being quiet. Maybe he just wanted to know where I was. And he's like, are you in here? And he can't see me. Maybe he's like short-sighted or something. Near-sighted, I think is what it's called. So this is a very tiny skull. But I, so when I saw it says build, I was like, well, hmm, that means it may have moving parts. Not necessarily, as we can see with the arm attached to the uh, rack of, rack of uh, the ribs and the whole basic construction. So it's not going to be the best thing. Well, this is about like what you would get at the Dollar Tree, unfortunately. So it's not, man, Zero's making a fortune off of this stuff. They're making a, a par stuff. 
at a price that, you know, people will throw their money in because they want the experience of pulling slime off the bones because we don't get enough of that in real life. Yeah, go to KFC if you want to pull some slime off the of bones. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I know some people are there like, but I like KFC. No, you know it's true. You get that chicken with the bones, you pull some slime off the bones. All right, let's keep on digging for, or not digging, let's keep on stretching slime. It's like I sneezed the dinosaur on my nose is what it seems like. Okay, got a leg. Oh, got a little bit of slime left on the leg. I like to use the slime to get the slime off. Here's the bottom of the jaw, so maybe Simps can go out and kill uh, a bunch of people with it. No, that's the jawbone of a donkey. Yeah, I know when people used to say, I'm going to kick your blank, I'm going, I don't have a donkey. Alright. We got one more half of the dinosaur. Something about well, the dinosaur. Um, I don't really know anything about that stuff. I remember hearing that song all over the place when I was a college person. Everybody walk the dinosaur. I was like, oh, that's a stupid song. A lot of stupid music back then. I was watching a thing on uh, a video about, uh, what are they called? Dino Riders and the Star Sheriff. Da, da. Dino Riders and the Star Sheriff. Da, da, da. It's a little too sticky. I mean, it's like really a little bit more sticky than I like it to be, that's for sure. Dino Riders and the Star Sheriff. I wonder why they made it like this. I guess I, I, I'm going to see if this will hold it and keep it fresh. Of course. There we go. I think that goes right there, doesn't it? Okay, right, there we go. I don't think that's a hole in the top. I think we can find out. We can see if it turns out the slime. All right, so maybe it's meant to put there. So we got these little skeleton bones right here. Dino Riders and the Star Sheriff. Dun, dun, dun. All right, so we put the two halves together. You got your chocolate in my peanut butter. You got my peanut butter in your chocolate. Two great tastes that taste great together. Okay, snot and slime. All right, so the head, the jaws go on the bottom of the head. And then, of course, there is the neck knob. This is a teeny little dinosaur. I wonder how it would fare against these. It's the same company. It's okay, so I think this is Zuru, right? It's the same company that makes those really cool, yeah, Zuru Smashers. So Smashers and what is that brand? The dinosaurs that I like a lot that um, they had look like Dino Riders. That's the reason I bought the Dino Rider thing, I think. And you know, unless I watched the video this morning as I was thinking about it. Dino Riders. And the star sheriff. Da, da, da. So those little dino riders are like they're little dino riders about this size. I wonder how compare. Well, it's a little less realistic. It's a little more cartoony with a giant head like that and the big old bug eyes because let's see, uh, skeletons don't have eyes. And what is this right here? I'm like a little confused that he has an extra tail. Like, okay, it's even it's in there, so it's not like it's an absolute something they messed up on. What? Oh, it, okay, so. If you look at the artwork, it's supposed to be a spear that's my, you know, killed him with, and I guess it got lodged in his vertebrae. All right, I thought it was an antenna on him or something. So not bad. It was three ninety nine for this, the slime and the volcano. So yeah, okay. So maybe I will, since uh, I think you know some people may have just came here for just this, and we'll do some more um, in a different video of the mini brands, since we got to see in this video some action figure stuff and maybe some people will come back for the mini brands so i can stop the video now and then i can go let my cat out and he won't be sitting there staring at me with the evil look he's like i want to go out i want to go out now uh, it's the things i get for letting the cats come in 20 times a day all right y'all have a great day um tune in next week no i'll probably put it on the same day so tune in for the next video when i put these other two things back here and we get to find out what's in there. Oh, man, this stuff is like buggers. It's like you can't get rid of them. That's why I don't have kids. All right, y'all have a great day. Bye.